Governor Nome delivered the annual State of the State Address today in Pierre before state lawmakers. The address kicks off the start of the 2021 legislative session, and now lawmakers know what the governor is hoping to accomplish this time around. Austin Goss was there, joining us live now from the state capitol. Austin, good evening. Good evening, Brian. Governor Nome laid out a bevy of policy proposals today, and while many of them were very conservative in nature, she also wants to keep doing what is bringing people to the Rushmore state. Governor Christy Nome today talked about banning abortions when there is a Down syndrome diagnosis, Americanizing the South Dakota education system, but also about doing more to bring people here. For those who have spent the last nine months shut down or locked up in other states, South Dakota is open. While Nome continued to spotlight South Dakota's unique COVID-19 response, she focused ahead. And as we look towards the year ahead, I'm also excited to report to you that there's a light at the end of the tunnel when it comes to our fight with COVID-19. Now, South Dakota is leading the nation in dispersing the COVID vaccine. In just over a month, tens of thousands of people across the state have received their first dose. Noam also brought up the things that have brought people to the Rushmore state, such as low taxes, recreational opportunities, and numerous career opportunities. House Minority Leader Jamie Smith says that while he appreciated the positivity, he and other Democrats would have liked to have heard more about the human impact of the COVID-19 pandemic. Um, things that we, we didn't hear as much was about people's personal health and things like that. We, we heard about the economic health of our state. Um, but the, the, the health of our individuals and our people across our state. And so what do we do uh, for the people that have contracted COVID and it has devastated them financially and also physically? The governor did not hold any kind of media availability after the event and left state lawmakers with even more on their plate heading into the next couple months. In Pierre Austin Goss, Dakota News Now. Austin, thank you. Dakota News Now is your source for State House 2021 coverage. State House reporter Austin Goss will have live reports every day during the session. Make sure you follow him on Twitter as well, at Austin Goss SD.